Hello chef here. So what we have here is some sourdough bread. And we're getting ready to put this in the wood fired oven. Just wanted to share this with you. These breads are on a uh, pizza peel. They're about a pound and a half a piece. They're pretty nice. The sun's been proofing them throughout the afternoon. Uh, they're lightly floured down below. So one of the things I'm doing here is just uh, scoring them very quickly like this. Just a couple of cuts across. Knife's got to be very sharp. And once you do the scoring, uh, then you want to put just a dusting of flour on top of each one. So that's it. These are ready to go in the wood-fired oven. I'll be back. Okay, so you can see the oven's not real big, but at this time right now, I've got four loaves of bread in there, and uh, you can just move them around and get to them pretty easily, and uh, wood-fired. I like it. Oh yeah, the finished sourdough bread. There you go, this is a couple of the loaves. Nice, not too heavy. Nice crust, you can see. Whew. Yeah. oven looking good yeah garlic on end grain walnut sometimes people ask us what's it like to uh, chop on end grain so here you go the knife makes a slightly different sound when you're on end grain and it's a little bit easier on the knife blade, so they say. Okay, so garlic real quick. Uh, just going up and down like this, it just goes right through. Of course, I've got a really good, really good uh, Japanese knife, and uh, that's it. Slice the garlic. Ah, garlic. Got a little bit of uh, garlic and extra virgin olive oil here. Wow, try that with sourdough bread. Amazing. Yeah, not too big, not too heavy, uh, easy to move around, super, super high quality, and you're buying an heirloom. 
This will last for generations as long as you take care of it. Share it with your friends. And if you need custom butcher block, counters, table tops, even this end grain, it's oh so nice to cut on. Contact a sponsor. They're having a sale and I know there's free shipping as well. Yeah, that, that is the good stuff right there. Professional cutting boards, chopping blocks, butcher blocks, custom sizes, many styles, all made in the USA. Countertops, walnut, oak, maple, cherry, all sizes, contact sponsor. Got my steamed asparagus on there, it's looking really good. The last thing I'm going to add to finish this drunken porterhouse recipe is some of the drunken juice right over the top like this. Oh yeah, thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button right down there. Get cooking, try the recipe. I'm making homemade vanilla extract. I want to show you these awesome vanilla beans. Sponsors label right here, Chef Depot label. Uh, you want to use these together or your own homemade with the beans. 
Yeah, use these together in any recipe and wow, it's gonna really, really kick. You're gonna improve it greatly. Pollinators love them. My standard right here, and that is this awesome Boost Mystery Oil. Love it. Second one is the board cream. Okay, board cream, good stuff. So, uh, you notice they're different. The board cream's a little bit thicker. You actually have to squeeze it pretty good to get it out of the package. And the oil is a little thinner. Okay, if chef asks you for some chopped fresh basil, that's what he's looking for right there. Not the garbage you see at the fast food places. You know what I'm talking about, like Chipotle and Burger King and TGI and all these crazy fast food places. This is perfect chopped fresh basil. Sourdough bread. Look at that stuff. Nice. Loaves. Learn more. Right there. Just search bread on this channel. Anyway, you can see how nice, how nice these slices are. Really, really beautiful. Okay, I've got 80 slices of uh, pear there from the uh, razor sharp knife. Yeah, check out your sponsor for all the good stuff. Magical mystery oil. Just a little bit like this. Plastic bag recyclable. Swirling motion. Good. Check out the huge selection at your sponsor. 
edge grain, end grain, maple, cherry, walnut, big blocks, small blocks, countertops, island tops, cutting boards, and many, many other wood products and applications. Oh, so nice to cut on. Contact the sponsor. They're having a sale, and I know there's free shipping as well. Yeah, that, that is the good stuff right there. So this one's kind of dried out. The surface is crying. Oil me, please. Oil me, please. And this one's fresh and ready to go. So that's the difference. You can see it right there. I highly recommend you get the uh, mystery oil and or the board cream. You just apply it like this, little circular motion. Yeah. I prefer to use a plastic bag. I'm just gonna put it on like this. Oh yeah. looking good already and this block has given me years and years of cutting chopping pleasure uh, primarily this one's used for serving fruits and cheese you can see it sucking up the oil yeah the oil protects it it penetrates into the wood and it makes it last for many many more years looking really good now yeah the other side same deal it's crying for some oil. Oh, let's give it the oil. There we go. Okay, the oil is on there. Circular motion, let it penetrate. Doesn't take very long, a little effort, but this maintenance is very, very important. So if you need to uh, score the oil, if you need to order the butcher block, I highly recommend you visit your sponsor. Uh, they have about 50 years of combined experience in butcher block and wow it's the good stuff Professional cutting boards, chopping blocks, butcher blocks, custom sizes, many styles, all made in the USA.